What's up, bullish friends? Hope you guys are doing well out there today. And man, I'm going to jump right into this story. So Michael Saylor of uh, MicroStrategy just bought $14.4 million more in Bitcoin. $14.4 million more. Now, that's pocket change for him in the fact that they already own like, uh, what is it, $4.47 billion. So, okay, and this is these stories are from uh, Bitcoin Magazine, so good uh Good post out from them over the last uh, 24 hours here. But yeah, 4.47 billion is what he owns. They bought another 14.4 million. And here's something else that's cool. They're going, they're um, attempting to raise another 750 million to buy more Bitcoin. Now check this out. So they basically have, they're putting up for sale their cla some class A common stock so they can buy even more Bitcoin here. So really, really crazy stories coming out on, on this. It, really interesting stuff. And I'll link to this as well in the description below. But, you know, right now we're sitting here and we're sitting at Bitcoin. Where are we at here? So we're under 30K right now. Over the last 90 days, there hasn't been a lot of action. There was a dip, went down to under 25,000. And then it's, you know, went up to what, 32? And then... Now we're just sitting here kind of spinning our wheels. And I know a lot of people are bored in this market. There's not a lot going on. There's not a ton of news. Um, so it's good to hear and it's good to see this kind of news come out. Um, and it's kind of, we're not really in a, uh, don't really know if we're in a bear market. We're definitely, to me, not a bull market, but we're just kind of bouncing around, going sideways, not really doing much. But long term, it's here in stories like this that, uh, solidify my thought process into being very bullish on the future of Bitcoin and not just Bitcoin, but uh, crypto in general. And I think Bitcoin leads the way on everything because obviously it's the big granddaddy of them all. So you need Bitcoin to go up and shoot to the moon. So these altcoins will shoot to the moon as well. And uh, that's kind of what I'm waiting on right now. I'm just kind of sitting here in this market just waiting for Bitcoin to do its thing. And it's going to happen, I believe, at some point, it's going to go back up again and, and really shoot to the moon. There's only so many of them to go around. It just, you know, and it's going to have again. So it's like, there's all kinds of good news to look at for the future of Bitcoin. And this guy is literally putting his money where his mouth is all the time. Like, he's either going to be the super most wealthiest man of all time uh, at one point or their company is going to collapse and you know into the pits so you know that's that's the only two options that are going to happen here but he, the guy is definitely putting his money where his mouth is so he bought 467 more bitcoin and like i said they're looking to raise another 750 million so guys i know right now the market's not really doing much. We're kind of looking at it, uh, but hang in there. I think, you know, as always, I'm bullish and I think the market's going to go back up eventually here. And uh, we're going to see some all time highs come up eventually coming up. Who knows when, but it's going to happen again at some point soon. So that's all I've got today in this video. I just wanted to share this news. I thought this was really interesting. And it's uh, always interesting to me when you see someone with a lot of money put in a lot more money into crypto and, and you know, again, Michael Saylor pumping into Bitcoin right now. Anyway, that's all I got, guys. I'll see you in the next video.